Guardian radar, we're okay for now, and we do have increasing clouds, so we're going to lose that bright sunshine that we had from yesterday, but we're still going to stay dry for quite some time today. So you're going to have that opportunity if you wanted to get out, maybe go for a longer walk with your dog, or maybe you just had some outdoor activities you needed to get done. But as we head into the evening hours, that's when we're going to see rain chances. So you'll need to plan everything around that as far as trying to dodge any rain. We're 34 degrees right now in Indianapolis. We still have those winds out of the south, so we're still streaming in that warmer air mass. It's helped bump our temperatures back up to seasonal levels. We're going to go above average for the next few days. But out the door this morning, we're at 35 in Muncie, 31 in Bloomington. So these temperatures are running about 5 to 10 degrees warmer from where we were this time yesterday. But there is a wind chill to be factored in there, so it feels like we're right around the freezing mark for most of us over Shelbyville. That wind chill right now is down to 19, Richmond down to 16. So you do still need that winter jacket as you're heading on out the door. Now on into the afternoon by the lunch hour, expect temperatures in the mid to upper 40s, and then we'll climb to temperatures in the mid 50s this afternoon. So that's average for this time of year. The average for the date is 54. Then on into the evening, we'll be cooling down to the mid 40s by 9, but those rain chances are going to be ramping up. So let's look at future view here. Taking us to the lunch hour, you're still okay. You're not having any rain around for the morning. As we go through the afternoon, I'm expecting most, if not all, of the afternoon hours to be dry. Here we are at 5 o'clock. I wouldn't rule this being sped up just a little bit, and maybe we see a few light showers off in our western counties by this point. But I'd say as we head towards 7 o'clock, we'll certainly be seeing some showers in the area, getting closer to Marion County, and then spreading east as we head through the rest of the evening. By 10 o'clock, most of us should have seen rain by this point. It's going to be on the light side and scattered, so it's not a whole lot that we're going to see, but enough that I'd say you definitely want the umbrella if you're going to be out tonight. We'll see this turn more spotty to widely scattered as we head into tomorrow morning, and then we'll have many dry hours tomorrow, but some hit and miss showers that'll be around. Temperatures, though, still climb to warmer levels. We'll start off in the low 40s in the morning tomorrow, and they'll climb to temperatures in the mid and upper 50s. Now, as we head through the rest of the week, we keep rain chances around. So after the round that we have tonight, a few spotty showers around during the day tomorrow, well, more showers returning as we head into the evening on Wednesday. We'll keep scattered showers around on into Thursday, too, with some gaps of dry time in there. And I'd say the heaviest rainfalls Thursday on into Friday as we have a frontal boundary that will come over the state, and it's looking to stall. So that's going to keep rain chances around as we close out this week. Between now and at the end of the day on Friday, we're looking to pick up quite a bit of rainfall where many areas could see upwards of two inches of rainfall. It really just depends on where that frontal boundary stalls to where we'll get those highest totals. So that's something we'll still fine tune over the next few days. High of 54 today, rain tonight, 57 tomorrow, widely scattered showers, more returning in the evening, and 67 on Thursday. We have a chance for some thunderstorms, maybe a couple of strong ones on Thursday too. Something again, we'll look closer at as we get a little closer to that. 51 on Friday, and then on into the weekend, we're looking at the better day being Sunday with a lot of dry time until we get into the late evening hours.